I don't know, I'd have liked to see something like this in the mercenaries. Yes, if you notice, I did get... Just to prove that I am somewhat good, I was able to get every stage, every character, five stars in Mercenary, because I have the hand cannon. So I'm not really this bad, usually. This is sort of a long game, and I don't want the recording to go on forever. So I am rushing a little bit. That's the other reason I want to get this over quickly. There's not that much to say. Until something funny happens. What are you talking about? Oh man! <laughs> that scared the hell out of me! Oh man! <laughs> I nearly threw my controller away in sheer panic there. Just turn around, there's this massive face. Ah! Alright, that's it. You can tell because the music has changed. Well, hadn't changed so much as isn't around anymore. Great, hang shotgun ammo. I could totally... I didn't want you to do that. I could really just start using my shotgun, basically. Oh, I'm mad. Uh, ammo? You guys suck! I hate you with an undying passion. I'm talking about the people who made the game, not you guys watching. <laughs> I wouldn't just be taking random uh, breaks just to, like, belittle you guys. You're watching my videos, that's, uh, that's painful enough. I don't need to insult you. You guys are doing a great job sitting there as I play a video game. If you guys watch this whole thing in one sitting, then you guys are amazing because I couldn't even take- I can't even take me for that long. Yeah. If you have a PlayStation 2 or a GameCube or a Wii, there is really no reason you should not have this game. It is amazing. If you have a choice, I would not go for the GameCube version. It doesn't have as many features as... PlayStation 2 and Wii, I think, are identical, feature-wise. But, uh, you're missing separate ways in the GameCube version. And, uh, I don't know, I really like... I've played, uh... I haven't actually played a version where you control it without Wii controls, but I have played uh, Resident Evil 5 without Wii controls, because it's not on the Wii. And they're essentially, they control essentially the same. Why'd I do that? They control essentially the same, so I'm pretty sure I know what it would be like. And I really like the Wii controls there. right, then I shouldn't get hit by a bear trap for the entire thing. I, however, will not be playing this game right, and will probably get hit by a bear trap pretty soon. Where is it? There it is. What am I doing? 
Stop playing with it on the TV again. Oh, that was expertly. I would like to see anyone do that in real life. Just shoot, like, a scythe out of the air like that. And... Have I gotten all the treasures so far? I think I have. I haven't been looking at my map. I have all the treasure maps, but... I think I've been doing pretty well. I'm playing most of this just from memory. So when you take that into account, I think I'm doing pretty good. Wow, that was epic. You really put up a fight there, you know, during that part where your head just blew up. Do I have... Yes. You could do this with, like, your knife, but it is so boring. Just throw a grenade down there. The other thing I like about this is at least starting the game over, you already have the extra large attache case. So, you can just carry stuff around. You can still fit all these fish in there, but it's a bit of a strain. Of course, I wouldn't have all these guns if I were playing this the first time, but... Whatever. I'm gonna stop talking about that. I'm gonna dwell... Oh, that's right. I don't have anything else to talk about. Alright. Here we go. What the hell? I cannot even hit a stationary target. Does the signpost mean more booby traps? Yes. And they're gonna trap quite a booby. I need ammo. I don't need money. This guy's able to shoot that. Stinks here too. Yay. Stinks everywhere. It's smelly. If you don't shoot that- Oh, I cannot- Alright. Oh, what the fuck? Okay, I told you guys it would happen, and it just happened. What was that? I am such an idiot. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. <laughs> I don't even know what was I going to say. I am triggering you. I don't even care if I'm not going that way. He jumped right- I've never even seen him jump straight into a second one. That was weird. Uh, that way, and... Two turns. That's as good as you can possibly do on that puzzle. See? I am amazing. You need to now worship me as a god. I don't need money! You. Yay! I don't know why they leave all this ammo around if they don't have any guns. One thing I did like, I didn't like the con- I didn't really like Resident Evil 5 that much, but I did like that they finally got guns. Instructed by Lord Sadler, I have the agent in confinement, alive, why keep him alive? I do not fully understand what the Lord's intentions are. No one does. I would, however, think he'd keep them separate, not combine them together as he has been ordered. Yeah, well, I don't expect Lewis will trust a stranger, but if by chance they did cooperate, the situation could get a bit more complicated. Uh-huh. If for some reason an unknown third party is involved, I don't think they'd let a chance like this slip by. Maybe it's all Lord Sadler's ploy, leaving us vulnerable so that the third party will surface if they eat and exist, that is, is unlikely possibility, but if a prowler is already amongst us and our plans could be ruined, I guess the Lord thinks it's worth the risk if we're able to stop whoever, whatever conspiracy is at work. At any rate, it's the Lord's call. We will trust his judgment as always. Well, that decision certainly won't lead to your entire order being utterly wiped out by Leon S. Kennedy. Uh, it will, actually. They're all textbooks written in English, but I don't have time to read them. 